always said that the film business was tough. That's why the Russians are financing that dumbass movie. They're using the production to smuggle in illegal weapons. Well, that's like Argo, but with guns. Put the gun down and show me your hands. Now turn around, slowly. What the hell are you guys doing here? We're finding the guns you're looking for. What guns? You didn't know about the guns? We came here to observe and report. We don't know any more about this case than you do. Well, then how did you guys get here? By retracing our victim's movements. He came here the day he died. He must have come across these guns. I'll contact the ATF, have them secure the weapons. Not so fast, Clarice. We're the ones who found them, so NYPD is going to be the one booking these into evidence. That's where you're both wrong. Those guns aren't going anywhere. You're the jogger. The guy up on the body. Just to put the gun down, we're federal agents. I'm a federal agent, too. Name's Ethan Wright, CIA. Hey, Mario Lopez, you make the call. Assuming you are who you say you are, why would the CIA be involved? Charlie Reynolds was working for us. I recruited him two years ago. Dewey was a spy? We used him to infiltrate the family of Anton Rankoff. Anton Rankoff? I know that name. He's the most notorious gangster in all Russia. He's also a major fan of Too Cool for School. That's why Charlie was taking all those trips to Russia. That's right. They love him there. So I approached him about using those trips to gather intel on Rankoff and his organization. Charlie didn't hesitate. And he was good. Turned out he was a better actor than most people gave him credit for. That's what I've been saying. Yo, this guy checks out. Oh, thank God my arm. So, Anton Rankov was using the movie as a front to smuggle arms into the U.S. for the Russian mob. And Charlie's job was to find those guns. More or less. 